Hello guys, so let's do this nice effect. I'm gonna delete the first two layers, we're gonna end up with this picture which I got from unsplash.com, I'm gonna put the link in the description below. And for the brushes, I use Splatter, which I'm gonna put the link in the description below as well. So let's start. As you can see in the layers, I painted black behind the picture because it's better for this exercise. And if you have a colored image, you can go to image, adjustment and desaturate so it can be black and white. So let's add a new layer and get the bucket tool and paint it white and then switch it to black because let's go to brushes and get to splatter one and paint once and splatter two, paint second time and six and then go to splatter nine and paint last time I think this looks fine you can add one more maybe or this is too much I think okay this is fine so let's go back to the layers and then go to select color range and with the eyedropper click on the black and put it on 150 fuzziness okay and now it selects everything then you go to select inverse it inverses the selection and mask and now you can see the face from behind just move the face in a better position if you want it I think this works and now you can add a new layer and you go to adjustment layers gradient and put it on maybe let's see the pinks maybe this one works okay and add the, put them close to one another so the color can be closer to one another okay okay and put this layer here and then decrease the opacity and here you go